Hello, this is Bloodstorm, and welcome to another Minecraft video inside my fantastic world. Today, in this video, I am hopefully going to be finishing off my new mini game, and I have a name for it now. But um, yeah, hopefully, we'll be finishing off the mini game. Uh, if not, then we'll definitely finish it in the next episode. But I don't think we've got a lot to do today. But first, let's go have my breakfast. And what should I have? Hmm. I think I'm going to have an apple for breakfast, Confridge. Nope, I got the opposite of an apple. It was a carrot. Right, anyway, let me go take the dog with me. And who I can't remember who I haven't taken in a while. Hmm. Dancer, you can join me. I can't remember. I try to take my dogs, make sure they like all get taken out equally. So I don't keep picking like one dog to join me. I might stop it in the future. Uh, because, yeah, I always take a dog with me. Well, not always, but I usually take a dog with me. And, uh, yeah. I don't know why. Um, but, yeah, I just keep losing track of um, who I'm taking with me. But, anyway, let's stop talking. Let me explain what we're building. So, we're building the new mini game, And let me tell you the name of it. So, the name of the mini game is called Bomb-It. Um, basically... Uh, like it says in the name, you have to bomb it. While well, the it thing is, don't worry, it's not the clown from that horror movie. Um, it's, um, what is it called? It's an end crystal. I just looked at the pig and it somehow reminded me of an end crystal. But uh, yeah, it's an end crystal. And they'll be on the top of those towers, which I've built in the last episode. Um, I've built, um, the middle part in, like, all the way. And I've destroyed a torch, and I want to replace it if I forget uh, the green. There we go. Yeah, I've added torches around the whole outside. I have the sign. And, oh, I need beds. That's something I need. And Dancer, don't go down the pit. Don't go into the void, okay? Oh, God. Oh, God, what was that? I was struggling to speak then. I was struggling to catch my breath. But, uh, yeah. I've built these towers out of the side of the video. I've done the walls. Uh, where these towers are, I've done obsidian down there. And uh, this llama has not been bothered to get out, so I decided to keep all these mobs here, especially the fox. And uh, yeah, I've laid out how the entire maze is going to be. Uh, I've also got the end crystals, and I have those end crystals for quite a while. And uh, yeah, I think it's time to get started. So, for the maze. It's going to be the same height as this, but I wanted to do the maze outside of video because I know I was going to struggle with building this maze. And yeah, uh, yeah, I decided to just build it uh, outside of video. I'll lay it out outside of video and then start finishing it off inside of video. I've just realised this reminds me of Pokemon for some reason, like the colours. So we have red at the top. Black for like the little middle part, and then white for the bottom part. Don't worry, it's not a Pokeball, okay? It's not a Pokemon thing. That's going to be the name of the title now. Not a Pokeball, that's what I'm calling the title. But yeah, let's build up these walls and let me explain how the mini game is going to going to play out. So basically, it's a one v one. Each player has either a wooden or stone sword. I don't know what sword. But yeah, I'm gonna have. Each player to have a wooden or stone sword. And each player is going to try to bomb each other's end crystals, which will be on the top. So, a way to set it up so it, like, tall towers, uh, to blow it up when they're on the tall towers, is have TNT at the bottom with end crystals in the middle. And then that end crystal blows up, and then I'll explode the one at the top, and that's how you know if you win. So, that's pretty much how the game's going to go. I've just realised I haven't got redstone on me. I'm going to be a very lazy cat, and I'm going to steal one from a mini game. And I know that's not like that's not very good, Storm. Don't don't do it, okay, Storm. But yeah, I'm going to be a lazy cat. I'm not bothered to cut out anything on the video. I'm going to be a lazy cat like I am in real life, and I am just going to steal it from a mini game. And which mini game will I be stealing it from? I actually have no clue. I might steal it from the... Oh, what is it called? I built it long ago. Uh, keep it lit minigame. 
I might steal it from there, so, um, because it's one of the closest ones that actually have redstone. With a redstone torch. That doesn't have a redstone torch, my Blaze mini game. Uh, but yeah, let's keep building these up. I'll do the red side for now, and then I can start building the towers. So, here we go. This is the red side done, and now uh, I'll do the red, the white side uh, when I finish. And all this obsidian, I've got my private explorer to go to go looking for it. And I already had like some in my ender chest from Christmas, which was last year. And I need to go over for Christmas list for this year because I don't know what to get. But yeah, the reason why I started building a fair in episode, uh, what was it? Episode, oh, I hate breaking obsidian. Uh, episode 10 was because I got a good head start from Santa. And all. How are these supposed to be laid out? I think it goes. So let's build the outline of the bottom of it first. Uh, here we go. I need to destroy this. I hate breaking obsidian. It just takes so, so long to break one little piece so i think i'll have it going obsidian in the middle i need to make sure oh wait oh no it is in the right place i thought it was in the wrong place then right so this is where it lines up to the top so we'll have well, actually no it needs to let me build the ring round first and then yeah so there's gonna be an end crystal on top of this, and I need to mark out where the second end crystal is going to be. So I'll put it up, an end crystal up there when I get it into one of these chests. And then I'll put another one down there, and um, drop, drop, drop down a minute. There we go. Yeah, I hate building out of obsidian. It's one of the my least favourite blocks to build out of. It's one of the most, well, one of my favourite looking, but I think my most favourite block probably has to be diorite polished diorite or obsidian i can't choose between them both for some reason i don't know why but yeah let me just build up here and all i've just realized you need tnt i ain't got it but yeah look at the end crystals they're not that hard to get you need glass and i can't remember what else but yeah you just need this and yeah my private explorer got some for me as well i need to add them to the shadow room but i did promise them i will add them to the shout out showroom eventually just not um not until the very end i'm gonna add them to the very end because without their help i wouldn't be able to build any of these and uh yeah but let's just drop down here fill in this part here i think i missed a part here there we go back up we go i need to turn my sensitivity up back to like 100 I got so used to that for like a day and then I just turned it off because it was a bit too fast. And then with the bow, I was a bit bad with it. But now that I am, um, like my sensitivity is a bit lower, I can easily shoot uh, shoot mobs with it. But let's just, oh, I'm right at the top here. Build out here. There you go. Break this, drop down. No damage. Well, I think I took half a heart, but that's okay. And oh no. Right, this is the part where I'm going to need to get a redstone torch. Right, let me go around this mini game. A little cheat way to get around. But uh, yeah, you'll be if you're on the red side, you'll obviously have to start on this side. And there is a chance that you can make that jump. I did try and it is possible. But yeah. Um, right. What was I going to do? Redstone torch, that's what I was going to get. Hopefully it doesn't break the redstone. Bit lit, but yeah, I'm just gonna be a lazy cat. I am um, out. Yeah, I'm just gonna be the lazy cat. I am. Call me Lazy Storm Zero Six. But yeah, let's. Oh no, I'm a bit stuck. I'm gonna take one from this corner here. And wait, what colours in here? Red. Oh, there you go. Yeah, I'm gonna take it from these two corners. So I only need two. That's the only redstone we need for this episode. But don't worry, I will replace it. So, yeah, uh, just re if you're recreating my world, just place it all back in. And, uh, right, let's head over back to back to the mini game. I need to sleep because there are phantoms about. Oh, how many phantoms are here? Not a lot. Right, Dancer, so you be careful over there. Try to survive the night. And I'm going to try surviving the night sleeping in this bed. And uh, in the morning, 
I can go place it back and I need to eat. I need to bring my fridge with me so I can have breakfast in the morning. Like every time I sleep. And I do have plans to change the texture pack. But let me just get around the maze this way. Here we go. Um, right. I need to get into here. I hate breaking obsidian. It's the worst block to break. Alright, there's nothing underneath here, which is good. Which means I can place it here. And then when I put TNT on top of that, it'll get lit. And I need to destroy this too. And I'll destroy this one too, because, yeah. If the TNT is, like, here, it will blow up, like, the red wall, which is around it. Yeah, that, that's supposed to represent the TNT there, that red wall. Oh, wait. I had a bed here the whole time. I could have just slept in here. Um, right, let me get the end crystals placed and I can start doing the white side. I won't do the maze for the white side because that did take a take uh, quite a while to do. But yeah, let's get in here and let me get the two end crystals out. Just like that. And right, I need, oh, I need to do this part again, don't I? So annoying breaking it. But yeah. Oh, hang on a minute. There needs to be obsidian there in the middle, like that. And then I'll place that there. And then when the TNT is down there and it explodes, it'll destroy this end crystal. And then there'll be an end crystal at the top. And yeah, that will get destroyed. And you have to look out when playing this game because, yeah, there's a chance that the end crystal might get broken and you might not even know. But yeah, this is pretty much how the game's going to look. I'm going uh, to jump down and start doing the white side now. And all. I'm about to die if I do that again. Right. Let's line it up. So I need to... Wait, is that lined up? Yes, it is. Let's just mark it out first. Oh, I'm placing it in the wrong way. I'm going to build slowly with this obsidian. Because, yeah, it is the worst block to build out of. But the good-looking block to use. And need redstone torques there. Oh, obsidian there. And, right... I left it like this. Hang on, I'm just remembering from memory. So there's a hole here. Slowly break that away. And right, I need to build up another layer. Uh, oh wait, no. There's red in the corners here. Oh, I hate breaking obsidian. I've said that like 10 times now. Uh, I need to put a counter up on the screen every time. I say, oh, I hate breaking obsidian. No, I'm going to be a lazy cat. I'm not, not, I'm not doing it. Um, right, let's put out the obsidian first so it's easier to easier to mark out where each of these things go. Uh, right, here we go. There's one. Where's this? Yeah, it is the top. I was just checking. So, this here. Oh, no. I am just the worst builder with obsidian. It's, I like this block. It looks good. Uh, when it's just this annoying to break, then yeah, it's, it's not the best block. And this needs to be built up here. And I don't know why, why did I build out of obsidian again? Why did I? Right, um, jump down here, I hope I don't die. Doesn't matter if I die. I thought I had nine lives, but no, nope, I don't have nine lives. I have infinite lives like any normal Minecraft player. Yeah, but let's jump down here. And, um, oh no, I've just realised I'm building out of the wrong wall. I need white wool and not red wool, which is very annoying, but it's much quicker than destroying obsidian, which is no problem for me at all. But yeah, let's destroy this, this part here. And I've just realised my last, my last video when I was building this, I... I was talking really fast and I had no clue that was happening. Well, I was speed talking and I had no clue. Unless it's just me imagining it. But yeah. The way I was talking, I was like non stop talking. Like, I did not stop. I don't know why, but usually I'm like having little breaks from talking. And then, yeah, I'll start talking like this. So let me give you an example of how I talk. So let's build this down here. This here. And there we go. That's pretty much how I talk. But for some reason. I'm starting to speak a bit faster now. Right, let's build this along up here. 
place this here and let's break this away. Hope I don't die or I am quite, well not quite low, I've lost half my health. Right, I think the easy way to build this is just doing it like this. There we go. Just doing one row at a time. And I'm going to have plenty of obsidian left so I can build something else with this obsidian. I don't know what else I'll build. Uh, I'll probably build another mini game with obsidian. Like, just break it the fastest. Like, there's a randomizer. And whoever breaks the obsidian, the fastest wins. Like, it gives you a certain pickaxe. And, right, let's break this here, there we go, and yeah, that's perfect, that's perfect, um, oh, I ain't got the, got the end crystals, hang on, let me get this out of this chest, and then that will be both sides complete, there you go, so that's the, that obsidian, I need to be careful not to break it when I'm here, because if I do that, that's not going to be good if I die, but there we go, that is the red side and the white side almost complete, Tell you what, I'm, I'm just going to do it. I'm going to build up this maze. And that'll be it. That'll be my entire Vomit minigame complete. And I'm looking forward to playing it. Uh, there is going to be some strategy to it. Either attacking or just camping your end crystal. But it depends if your opponent is good at PvP. If they are good at PvP, just try hiding in like a corner and then you can just ambush them when they're not looking and they just not expecting it that'll be that'll be a good ex um excuse not excuse um a good way of winning a good little tip that's what i was meant to say but yeah let's finish off this part and i can end the episode off here and oh what am i doing in the next episode oh i know no not the next episode what am i doing after that i actually can't remember what i'm doing after I've built this mini game, I'm, I can't remember. I'll have to check my notebook, but I think I'm building another mini game, which is a fan idea, and it's over there. And I'm looking forward to that mini game because when I designed it and started testing it out in my design world, it's actually a really fun mini game. And you just have to be very careful and just, uh, yeah, just don't go, don't go slow, no slow. Oh wait, no, I just, wow, I've just given the hint. To the mini game, yeah. Just don't go slow in the mini game. You have to think fast and yeah, just be quick in the mini game. But there we go. This is my vomit mini game complete. In the next episode, I am going to uh, be playing this mini game. I'm going to have a little mini tournament. I need to add TNT in that chest. But yeah, each player is going to have one piece of TNT. I'm going to fix my keep it lit mini game and put those redstone torches back. And yeah, hopefully. I'll win this tournament. I think, yeah, I won the swoop. Not swoop. Um, what's the mini game called? Oh, glide. Yeah, my brother, my brother Ethan was on about how this mini game could be called like swoop or like fly or like I can't remember. Was it my brother? I can't remember who it was, but someone said I should change the name of this to something else. Yeah, it just got stuck in my head and I've just fallen. But yeah, that's the end of this episode here. You can stand up dancer. And uh, yeah, I'll thank you for watching and I'll see you all next time. Bye.